Hello and welcome back to Lawrence Place. Sir, I'm being hunted. Very, very quiet. I'm sure there's robots around here somewhere. So how are we getting on? Let's see, in the last episode, we managed to bring back two of the artifacts to the stone circle. So I've got three of them in total now. There's a robot. I don't think it's seen me though. No, I think I'm okay. There's two of them. hunting, Full hunting party. Don't look, no, they've definitely not spotted me, but they are worryingly close and they're patrolling the area that I'm trying to mess around in, which is unfortunate. I was thinking I was going to go and unload some of the stuff from my inventory in these houses because it's nice and close to the start point, uh, to the stone circle, which is obviously somewhere I'm going to keep coming back to. So, um, yeah. Let's have a look in here. Okay, we don't need any of this stuff. This is all rubbish. And I've got more of... Well, let's keep let's keep one set of bandages. Two alarm clocks and one train is probably sufficient. I expect two pies and some pickled onions is probably enough. For that I'm not going to take the cat food with me. Okay, that's that's a bit more sense bit more sensible now. So my plan in the last episode was basically to get to the edge of the island. And to walk and to f just follow the coastline around in an attempt to, in theory, cover all the ground. That said, if I see some of those blue fairy things, it might be worth following those because they seem to be quite good for telling me where to go and help me helping me find things. So let's, let's head over this way because the hot air balloon is up there. There's some robots behind me. I haven't got the sound turned up high enough. There we go, now I can hear stuff. Including some robots. So that's a church over there. Oh, I'm heading northwest again. That's not particularly helpful because I've already got that one. Uh, let's head a bit more northwards through this field. I don't know if I've been to this village yet. Let's um, have a look, see what we can find. See if there's anything useful in these houses as I go past. Nope. <laughs> I feel like I'm finding a lot of distracting, distracting things, like the alarm clocks, but not so much of anything that actually helped me deal with robots from close close up. I'd like to find a, a gun to use all of that revolver ammunition I've been picking up, and I'd, or even maybe a um, a rifle to pick them off from a bit further away. I'm doing the thing where I pick up absolutely everything that's useful from all the buildings and end up with my inventory completely full. <laughs> I'll have to make sure I ditch it all, or drink drink and eat it all before I um, go and try and pick up another artifact, otherwise I'm just going to get there like I did in the last episode and go, oh no, my inventory's full. Ah, a hatchet, finally. A weapon? Do be careful with that. I really think violence is best left to the experts. Excellent. Not so harmless anymore. Ooh, blackberries. Let's just eat those straight away. If your antagonists have hunting dogs, then might I suggest you stay well away? Those beasts have a nose for blood. Oh no, not dogs already. Yeah, there's a dog. Okay, that's going to make things a bit more dangerous, I think. Oh, which way was I going? Right, stone circle is off that way, and the dog's that way as well, so let's go in the... Let's carry on heading west, because that takes me both away from the stone circle and away from the dogs. <laughs> and there's another village over here as well. I can see those robots over there. I'm not using my torch when it's like that. He says immediately using the torch again, briefly. Ah, oh, here's the door. Yeah, I think this might be the same church I've already been to. That means I've already been in this area and therefore probably already picked it up. Oh, I've just gone the same way again, for goodness sake. There's a couple of them up there. There we go, there's another smokestack. I can hear robots over there. This grass is long enough that when I stop moving, I'm completely invisible. Yep, yeah, there they are. 
That was three of them this time. That's going to make... Oh. Two hunters and a dog. Great. Okay. I still don't have any ranged weapons. And I now don't have remotely enough space in my inventory for storing everything I've don't know how sensitive the dogs are. Oh, that's very close. Which way is it going? Slightly that way. Okay, if I keep going this way, hopefully it won't... Hopefully it'll go past me without alerting anyone. That's closer than I want it to be. Now, there are a couple of options here. One is to creep in there and hopefully not get noticed by any of them. Grab the artifact and run away. Or sneak away again. I could put down an alarm clock and hope that distracts them enough. I think that's probably the best idea. And maybe put down a bear trap as well. That's not a bad idea. Let's set this for the maximum time. Drop it here and put a bear trap here as well and then I'll have the hatchet ready in case things go horribly wrong and if I sneak round to the other side I've got a minute to get there, this is quite a narrow bit of land as well which doesn't help I don't want to go down there because I'll probably fall in the water just go around this side here Okay, I'm completely hidden. I get a little bit closer to that rock. Hopefully the alarm clock will go off quite soon. I don't know how long I say, how much longer is left of that minute. <laughs> there we go. What is that? There we go, perfect. That's how we like it to work. Oh, I think one of the robots got hit by the bear trap as well. Excellent. <laughs> that worked really well. Now, if, based on previous experience, they're probably going to go away now because they they somehow know that there's nothing worth guarding, but they don't they don't put two and two together and work out that, that means I've gone off this way. And the question is. The dog is still jump running around. I think that took out one of the humanoid robots. I don't know whether it destroyed it or whether it's just damaged it. But if it's destroyed it, I might be able to loot the body. No, I see. From here, I can see there's the one walk one guy walking there, and the dog's bouncing around as it does. The other one seemed to be lying on the floor. Its light was pointing up in the air. I, s I saw it earlier. Maybe I can get in there and finish it off. I don't know. How do you do? There we go. Okay. Now, I thought the robot went down and I only saw one of them going away. So I was hoping that I might be able to loot the uh, remains of it but there doesn't seem to I don't see a robot around here which is a bit of, bit of, bit of a shame um, maybe it wasn't fatal that's a shame oh well I got the trinket let's head back and uh, deposit it so where am I I'm at the southeastmost extreme of the island so if I head back out this way then I should be able to sort of carry on from where I've got to there's the balloon and I think that was a stone yes there's a stone circle as well so I'm nearly back. I've not seen any robots on my... Oh, there's some over there in that village. It looks pretty safe. I 
few more of those, and we can activate the device. Okay, there's quite a few more. Okay, back to the southwest again. I'm going to carry on from where I, where I was before. Right, here we go. Here's the coast. There's a boat there. I think the boats are at the four cardinal corners of the island. And I think over there, yes, that's where I... Where my binos there? My binos. Was that where I... I think that's where I got the last trinket from, so... Yeah, I'm back where I back where I was before. Let's carry on around the around the coastline. I kind of want to climb this hill and have a good look around, but I don't really want to silhouette myself against the sky. Even though I don't. Oh, there it is. I don't see any robots. That worries me and makes me paranoid. <laughs> Maybe it's just in such an awkward place that they've not really been able to get to it. Oh, it's a tiny one. It's nice and easy. Oh, it's the uh, Kraken. That's all right. <laughs> uh, I hear noises. And I saw a red light over there in that village. I wonder if I can hide in the phone box. Oh, that's another new type of robot. Oh dear. Let's um take a slightly more <laughs> evasive route around that. Oh, but now I've got a hedge to bolt. And did they see me? Or was that just wildly shooting? They do seem to just wildly shoot sometimes. Where's that big robot gone? Oh. I don't want to go that way because there's guards in that village. I don't want to go this way because there's the big robot, which is scaring me a bit. Although it does seem to have gone. And there's not very much cover on this outside the field. Yeah, okay, he's going the other way. There's nothing on the road. Okay, get across in here into the woods again. Now I can start heading back to the stone circle. over by the... Well, it's not quite where I'm wanting to go, but... Yeah, it's heading directly towards me. I don't want that. <laughs> and I can hear more robots this way as well. Right, back at the stone circle now. Where's that hot air balloon gone? I've lost it. I've lost sight of it. Oh, there it is. Okay, that's not coming this way. Good. Oh my god, what is that? <laughs> right, yeah, the game is definitely starting to ramp it up now that the um, that I'm making progress. I'm putting the kettle on now, sir. We'll have you home in no time. Okay, so I need to head off to a different island now. I don't know which coast is the closest. Um, that big stridey chap is going that way, so if I go west, that takes me straight past, straight towards that robot. Great. Um, but I can go round, loop around this field. Through, or through this field, actually, a better idea, because then I'm hidden. There's one. I don't know if I can...
come back to the um, the boat and store artifacts that I've found in it. If I have to go all the way back to the stone circle on the central island every time I find an artifact on the other ones, or abandon my entire inventory in order to fit stuff in, that's going to be a bit annoying. I guess we'll see. I had an idea of going back to the um, that village up there on the on the on the bank in order to stock up on consumables for my vitality, which is down. There to are a number again. of islands in the archipelago. Each of them is likely to have fragments of the device for you to collect. Try not to get lost. But I think that's a worry for the next episode. I'm going to head off now across the ocean and start the next one on the other side. Thanks for watching and I'll see you over there.